He is the greatest two-sport athlete of all time. He won the Heisman in 85 and spent a couple of years with the Sox. Bo Jackson joins us. Chef Paul Guerrero is also here. Paul, good morning to you. Good morning, Larry. Bo, good to have you good with us. Larry. How are you? Good to have you with us. Have you been watching the Sox? How do you think they're uh, going to do this year? Actually, I can't stay up that late. <laughs> I've gotten to the point to where when I get home between five and six, the pajamas yeah. are on, and whatever time my eyes close, they close. So usually, <laughs> I don't make it past the fourth inning. <laughs> you look like you're still bench pressing. Your hands are enormous and frightening. I tell you what, I don't lift anything but the toilet seat and my golf clubs. <laughs> That's about it. Do you think we'll have another two-sport athlete like, like um, you? The, the, the talent level is is it is too deep. Yeah. It's it is too rich. Um, if you try to do both now, you end up sitting on the bench. Yeah. Well, you have kids focused on one sport from the time they're five. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's why the talent is so rich, or I don't know. Do you think that's a bad way to go for parents with their um, kids? I don't believe in helicopter parents, if that's yeah. what you mean. Yeah. I think you should let a kid just be a kid. Yeah. If he wants to play baseball this week and soccer next week and basketball the week after that, let him because yeah. then they'll find out what sport they're yeah. truly good in and yeah. the sport that they like. And sports has become big business. What do you think about these licensing agreements in college? To be honest with you, I, I don't keep up with it. I'm yeah. so busy yeah. running around the country and 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 uh, and um, and um, prepping my uh, food products. Sure. So, to be honest with you, I don't even have time right. to watch sports. Well, before we get to the food, can we show a couple of Bo Jackson highlights for the, for sure. the younger generation that may not remember? Let's take a sure. look at the first one. I believe it's a 91-yard run. I oh, know this is a, this looks like a uh, Guess exactly. ball that's climbing the ball wall. Me, I think. <laughs> All right, let's watch this. This will be fun. And Bo Jackson to the that was on my birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday to me. It's like sometimes you can't just tell how fast everybody is on the field when you're watching on TV. You can tell watching that clip. <laughs> I was young. <laughs> I was, like, I was young. It was like you playing against Pop Warner kids. I think we have one more. For, for those who don't remember, uh, Brian Bosworth was like a big <laughs> darn deal linebacker back in the day. And here you are <laughs> taking him for a ride into the end zone. It looked like you might have said something to him afterwards. Did you say something to him? We can't say it on no, the we can't. <laughs> What's it like watching these old clips? The only time I watch them is when somebody show them. Yeah, I know. Um, um, every now and then when I'm on, um, I'm on my computer and I'm and I'm YouTube and watching certain videos, probably mainly hunting and fishing. Man. My videos come up and I just yeah. skip right over them because I know what I did there. Go to if that was me, I'd watch them every day and I make my kids watch them too. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's cook. What are you What are you What are you cooking for us today? Uh, today it's all plant based. We have yeah. um, We have a uh, plant based beef, plant based chicken. We have, we even have our plant based um, cheese sauce for our uh, Philly cheesesteak. We have uh, plant based chicken nuggets, plant based ready to eat mm -hmm. meals, plant based drinks. Now the thing with with uh, Jackson with Jackson and Partners, and I think we want to be um, industry this industry disruptors in a positive way. Mm -hmm. So, And what I mean by that is giving the people what they want, mm -hmm. uh, um, having the people to be attracted to our products first with their eyes, and then have them to be curious. I want to take this home and try it once like you do. Yeah. And then once they try it, they're hooked because I say don't buy my product big, big, just because I'm associated with it because if you do, you yeah. are an idiot. <laughs> you take it home and yeah. I, but, and I, but and I bet the farm that this product will sell itself. Yeah. So, because that's what people are wondering. Okay, plant-based meat, it, it, it'll be healthier, but does it taste like meat? Well, I will, through COVID, mm -hmm. I worked with our food scientists our, and, but, and our ideation team for almost two years. And we've gotten it down packed to where um, we haven't had 
anyone to say, hey, I don't like this. But in the way we do that is we have had testers, mm -hmm. the world's professional testers, which are kids from three to seven <laughs> years old. Yeah. And you know, kids don't have filters. Right. So when they try it and if they spit it out, we know we got to go back to the drawing board. Yeah. And it's, but, and, but and it's a beautiful thing to have a three-year-old wanting yeah. third helpings of your chicken nuggets or your plant-based meals because they don't know. They don't have a bias no. against what, what it is. Right. Absolutely, yeah. 100 percent. So uh, right now, Chef is preparing one of our Philly cheesesteak sandwiches, and 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 even the sauce, like I said, is plant based. The sauce is plant based. The sauce too. is plant based, mm -hmm. and uh, once it cools off, because I don't want you to. Yeah. I don't want you to burn your mouth, but so I you want you to taste it. Let, let me see. Let's do this while that cools off, because yeah, that right. is on fire. How about we play? A little uh, getting to know you with Mike Toomey and while that cools off, and then I'll try it when we're done. How about that's, that's, a, good, that's a tease, Mike. Thanks, Larry. We know he's an athlete and an executive, but what else? It's time for a little game called Does Bo Know? All right, first question Does Bo know which of these television shows he was a guest on? Is it MASH, Full House, Fresh Prince of Bel Air, or Seinfeld? Hmm. Does Bo know? Um. I'm not gonna get slapped, am I? No. <laughs> Fresh Prince of Bel Air. I think we have a correct answer there. Look All at right. Oh, this is the special we one hour Fresh Prince of Bel Air starring Quincy oh. Jones, Kadeem Hardison, Malcolm Jamal Warner, Tyler Collins, Heavy D, I'll be sure, and my main man, Bo Jackson. Yo, man, what's up with that? Why you say my name last? <laughs> Monday night, Fresh Prince of Bel Air starring Bo Jackson, Bo Jackson, Bo Jackson, and Bo Jackson. Monday. Wow, I totally <laughs> bought that. You're a good actor. <laughs> so far, we're one for one. Next question Does Bo know the name of his own video game for the original game? Game Boy Portable Gaming Ooh. System. Hint, it's two games in one. No Tecmo game. Bowl. Is that correct? Let's roll it. This one, oh I have not seen that. Oh, that Technology. One. Oh, this is a different one. This is a different one. It's called Bo Jackson's Hit and Run. Oh. See? Did you forget about that? Yes, I did. <laughs> you did. Uh, boy, you know I, you're a big deal when you forget about the video games that were made for you. I, I got to check to see if I'm still getting royalties from that. <laughs> <laughs> we really captured your likeness in that one. Here's the next question. Does Bono, in 1992, which American hip-hop group referenced him in the opening lines of their song? I haven't a clue. Really? I haven't a clue. Let's roll Let's it. Let's roll that. Well, they challenged you. They said you don't know how to rap. I had to lay down the challenge. They were right. <laughs> they were right. <laughs> Throw down a tribe called Quest referenced Bo Jackson in their song Scenario. Next question, does Bo know? Let's just say you were on a Saturday morning cartoon show fighting crime and helping children. <laughs> Who are the other two athletes that you might choose to fight crime with? Oh, that would, that would be Michael Jordan and Wayne Gretzky. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that's exactly right. Let's take a look. Wow, Michael Jordan and Bo Jackson? It's really you. Hey, and Wayne Gretzky, too. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here, but I'm almost afraid to tell you what I did. Wow. <laughs> oh, take it easy, little bro. Don't worry. You can level with the pro stars. Not your voice, though. No, that's yeah. not my voice. I don't <laughs> have a movie voice. But they did do the live stuff. action stuff where you were on camera, oh, setting mm -hmm. up some of those segments. Yes, yes. Hey, he batted 500. That's good. That's Two right. for four. Very good. All right. Now, tell me what you think. You can tell right away it tastes like beef. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, very good. Just like I said, but the thing that we've done over COVID, COVID made it to where, um, to where you couldn't do anything. But um, I would get in my truck, drive, go yeah. meet the, the the food scientists and everybody, and uh, we worked for weeks and weeks and weeks until we yeah. got and, something that was. And so, Paul, palatable. is that not is that not cheese? It's not cheese. It's soy based. Wow. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. Plain. You're like a magician. Thank you. <laughs> Not only that, we, yeah. uh, um, 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 our products right now, we're in, um, we are nationwide with 
our products. We're in uh, Publix, we're in Whole Foods with our plant-based drinks, um, um, with our plant-based jerky up front, which is called Gotcha. It, the reason we call it Gotcha yep. is because you don't know that it's plant-based, yeah. period. So it's like it's stuff. Studio. And so that's what I've been doing. That's yeah. why I don't know anything about sports. <laughs> that's all right. Because I've been busy doing this right Listen, here. Listen, you don't have to do anything. Corporations will hand you the check to promote their product anytime for the next 20 years. I wish. Uh, stick around. Uh, we're going to do some more with uh, Bo Jackson coming up. I don't know if you know that, but you, you are. Uh, stay with us. <laughs> We'll be right back. <laughs>